Wait. Are you sure you should continue? Maybe... Maybe we should leave things as they are. As you wish. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kamsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. I chose not to play his twisted little game. There was no reason to kill that android. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? 
What do they really want? All Cyberlife wants is to resolve the situation and keep selling androids. You didn't tell me everything you know about Deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the Deviants, or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can... Hank, you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. We could have solved this case. We just needed more time. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? When the Deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. But now it's too late. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. I don't know why I did it. I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. With a little more time, who knows? We might have even become friends. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. to the basement is on my desk. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. Perkins, you fucking cocksucker. <gasps> Fuck off! 
Leave me alone! He's totally lost it. Give me another shot at that little hey. prick! That's gonna cost you your badge, you lunatic. <laughs> you little know, oh. lunatic, oh. my fuck. Come on, that's enough, <laughs> Lieutenant. <laughs> that bastard. Shit, I think he broke my fucking nose. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been ordered to return to Cyberpunk. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave immediately. Good. Be careful on your way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. Hard-boiled, eccentric police lieutenant choose. Obviously. Where is Jericho? The answer's here some somewhere. our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus, where are you hiding?
one of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. You lied to me. I need to find Jericho. Do you know how to get there? You're wasting your time. I don't know anything about Jericho. But I hope that one day, you pay for what you did to me. Deviant, like you. I need your help. I want to go to Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. choice they'd have killed us all you'll be all right i came to take you home just give me the location to jericho we've got to leave now jericho yes yes of course Me again, Marcus. Don't leave. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit! Get the alarm now. <laughs> <laughs> 